think he would be very happy to see that his legacy has been carried on by his successors and that Singapore diplomacy in the world has uh, flourished. That Singapore is held in high esteem by the world community and that uh, we have been able to play a positive and leadership role in many international meetings. I think he would be very proud that the foreign policy that he crafted and helped define um, stood Singapore in, in such a good stead, you know. And Singapore today, uh, although a very small state, punches well above its weight. And I think this is a testimony of the success of its foreign policy. I think he would be very proud to see um, a good part of his vision having come true. I think we are on our way to becoming a Singaporean Singapore. If he was alive today, he would still be somebody I respect immensely. He would be very pleased, happy, satisfied um, that we had done very well in Singapore. We had progressed so much. And I think he would uh, really be very pleased with our foreign policy. And Singapore is highly respected in the international stage. Our positions on issues and our views on issues are very well considered and people see our positions and views as benchmarks. Mr. Rajaratnam would be happy to see the third generation of leaders are doing so well of taking care of Singapore, the people, and collaborating with other worlds. You will be happy to see that Singapore is a prosperous uh, country and uh, Singaporeans are living uh, harmoniously. I think he will be very proud to see the foreign ministry has been as extended. I think he will be very, very, very surprised to see that we progress so fast so advanced in so many things, especially our international relationship. It would be wonderful and educational to hear his analysis of the world situation and how, and how he would position Singapore. I think he would be able to help galvanize people together on his favourite subject and dream of a truly multiracial nation. He must be very happy to see Singapore is now gone up. People with better lives. The government is doing so many things for elderly people. So he must be very happy. He would be very pleased to see the trend of uh, more inter-ethnic marriages as that would be a sign that the idea of a Singaporean Singapore is indeed taking root. <laughs>